Okay, it's time to take a look at the papers this morning. We'll be looking at the headlines uh, with none other than leadership and communication strategist Dr. Ojon. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, good morning. Good, good morning, to see you. Good morning, Mike. Really good to see you. Yeah. All right, let's begin with the Punch newspaper now. Mm. APC Chair Oshamale attacks Obasanjo Amoso Okorocha says God will punish ex president for supporting Atiku. will win without Imo Ogun, governor's APC chair, is saying that. Well, <laughs> the, the, the hard stands have really begun one way or the other. Yes. Um, starting from the point of integrity, I'm an author and um, um, I've published one and written a few others. If I put something in my book and at the end of the day, if I perhaps after some years because of um, the situation of the exigencies the, of, the exigencies time. of time, I now decide to go 100% U-turn or 360, it's, it doesn't speak well of me as a person. Before you publish a book, it must be a compilation of your thought and your belief. And your you don't suddenly, and convictions, you don't suddenly come and say, oh, I felt like this yesterday and today, even when it is glaring that nothing has totally changed. There are times that a lot of things may actually change that mm. you are actually, uh, b b but in this case, nothing has changed. But what if but those again, convictions that you had at the time you, write, you wrote uh, the book were based on the information that was available to you and from the perspective from which you actually saw things at the time. But you, you and with the benefit of hindsight, but you you're never, seeing it differently. But no, you, you never came out to say that anything has changed. The only thing that has changed is your, perhaps, the, the way you view the man in power. So when you look at it from that angle, I, I, there's a question as to integrity there. But again, it is not the duty of man to determine who God but, will punish mm -hmm. at that point in time. You see, the way we play God in Africa, okay. we, we, we hide mm -hmm. God under our religion. Okay. We cannot well, well, but understand the, the, him. the national chairman of APC was actually, actually going straight to quote the line where the former president said, God will punish me mm. if will not I... Forgive me. Uh, will, will not forgive me. Will not forgive, me. exactly. Yes. So, not and, forgive and, he, me. and he said and that it, he's incurring the wrath of God. Of God. You know, so, and all of that. But let's, 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 <laughs> let's move forward from there. Nigeria will be delivered from oppression, says uh, David Oyedekbo. Okay. Farashi in road crash on 3rd Mainland Bridge. Mm. It was said that his vehicle ran into a stationary vehicle, uh, vehicle yeah. on, the, on the 3rd, on the 3rd Mainland, Mainland Bridge. Bridge. Yeah, but I understand he is stable and uh, mm. nothing really well. happened, nothing yes, happened to I'm, him. I'm really happy for him Thank because... Thank God we've um, been spared the grief. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, that's the punch newspaper. Would that be all? Mm. All right. To the Daily Sun, Farashi survives auto crash on 3rd Mainland Bridge in Lagos. Gunmen invade Oshun School, kill one and kidnap uh, five and this this happened in uh, Saoke. Yeah. Uh, very troubling. I mean, are we beginning to hear about gunmen invading schools in this part of the country now? Yes, I, I think the picture because I know the place very well. The and I tried to contact a few people. The picture is that those guys were actually robbed in. That was not the first time they were robbed in that mm, environment yes. in that area. And the school bus and the student actually ran into them, and they felt that it's uh, it's a better opportunity mm. for them to to gain uh, more money and gain more money. So that's why they, they kidnapped. Mm. It's quite unfortunate that um, one person died, and um, a policeman actually sustained injury. But again, um, this is not the time to think that insecurity is a problem of the north. It's actually walking into our vicinity, into yeah. our gate. Yeah. And government, again, we cannot be tired of telling government that if any government fails in the area of insecurity, it's a major disaster and failure. Yeah. All right. Uh, well, COP, a coalition of uh, political parties, adopts Atiku as consensus candidate. Of course, uh, the ruling party has been saying, well, it's, it's just a group of the same, same old, same old. No, I mean, the, the, uh, they can't lose any sleep over this. Uh, no, that, that, that's not true. You and I know that uh, <laughs> either it is small or not, any support in politics actually can't. Mm. That's why they it, say politics is a game of numbers. It's a game of numbers. So that's so one if, extra. If you, the, 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 the fact that you have, the truth parties? is that, the fact that you have 40 something political parties mm. shows that one political party, each of them has a national chairman and a national secretary. Mm. And they have a family member. Mm. And they have a few people in their village. They also areas of in influence. their ideology. Mm. An area of influence here mm. and there. So if a group of political parties, either they are one member or two or three, are coming together to say we are supporting something. I think it's something to be concerned about for the ruling party. Okay. And nobody should uh, come out to say they are we'll not We'll get Tezani. Magu EFCC boss vows says $300 million loot stock in UK. Uh, Magu's been saying, look, if you bring her back within 24 hours, 
I'll be prosecuting her. All right, Taraki to Buhari, sign new electoral bill now. Uh, PDP, APC, not sincere about restructuring. Uh, Ume is saying that. That's the truth. That's the truth. You know, 20, everything is like we are going back to history. Everything that is happening mm. in 2018 is like exactly what happened in 2014. In, 20. in 2014, the, the card was, oh, we are going to restructure when we get there. Mm. Now they enjoy the reality of government at the national level. Yeah. The first restructuring should be redefined. Mm. And that's what PDP is coming to say again, we are going to restructure. I will not be surprised if Nigerian people give them the power and they by there. another time they get there, they can restructure their restructuring <laughs> and redefine. <laughs> you, you understand? Re redefine their redefinition. Yeah, yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. New Telegraph is our next paper now. Oshomole, God will punish a passenger for supporting uh, Atiku. Okay, we've read that before. Says electorate. Isn't that what we'll kids deal. used to say? Mm. You know? Mm. Mm. And as a parent, you, you smack them from the, mm. you know, I mean, you just for, smack for, them for, for even using for such using, language. Exactly, for saying that. <laughs> uh, well, he says electorate will deal with Okorocha Mosu in 2019. Coalition parties adopt ex-vice president as consensus candidate. And PDP Sokoto government attack a Rufai over rented uh, crowd claim. Mm. Okay. Uh, gunmen heard us kill abduct poly college health workers in Ondo, Oshun. The kidnappers demand a hundred million ransom mm. and uh, hunters vigilantes hunt for abductors it's really a troubling one criminals drug barons buy houses for police Whoa. ex igp is revealing this hmm. this you, is a troubling one it is Very a troubling disturbing. one it is a troubling one I, I i i hope that we will never know the extent at which corruption has actually destroyed us as a people. Mm. And it is scary that nothing has been done to prevent it in the future. My generation, now the way it is, is even worse than the past generation. It shows that we have not been taking preventive measure over time. What we've been doing is that, oh, we are going to fight corruption and we arrest some few people. Mm. Unfortunately, this is even emboldening the people. Because if you arrest somebody for corruption case and you take he or she to court and nothing is done. Mm. The way EFCC was making out before Fire she left left office, an average person would have thought that by now Fire she would be behind bar. But you don't fight corruption in a system like this without taking the judiciary along. There's mm. no how they will frustrate your effort because there's corruption in judiciary. That was why I was thinking in the first place that when this man was coming in power and was campaigning that he was going to fight corruption, the, the president was coming to power. I thought that he was going to start with the judiciary. So in other words, the no, institutions no, that really should have been above board have found themselves, inside, you know, in, in, right in inside corruption. it. I mean, remember Lawrence Anini, uh, the Monday of Sumbo yeah. incidents in the 80s, mm. where, uh, was it George Iyamu, the, the uh, police, the police officer, officer who was found, who was, you know, uh, culpable, uh, actually they, working they, they, hand they, in you, hand you, with the uh, You see, you see, there's criminals. no robbery case. Yeah. There's no robbery case. There's no kidnapping case. There's nothing in Nigeria that will happen. And the police will not do will anything not, about mm. it without their knowledge. If okay. you kill a policeman, you will see how, how they would mm. deal with the issue decisively. All right, yeah. moving on to the vanguard. Oshomole bombs Obasanjo Amosun and Okorocha. As a matter of fact, he said, look, uh, we're going to win Ogun State, Imo, Imo State, State, without uh, Amosun He has even Okorocha. said that the, 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 those governors they're, they're are electoral liabilities. Liability. <laughs> electoral liabilities. Wow. I, I, I'm surprised that the Ondo State governor is not part of those people. Maybe that one is a little bit uh, um, strategic with his own move. What they are doing now is that Majority of them have actually moved to AA. And the politics behind that is that when you go, when we have, I don't know the number of parties we are going to have in the ballot paper at the end of the day, when you go to cast your vote, there's a possibility that an average illiterate is thinking about APC. Now they have moved out tactically from APC. What they, are, what they have done is to pick the party that is above <laughs> APC in the paper. So that when you bring the <laughs> paper, you see, yes, you see AA, for example, you before you a, get just, to APC, uh, okay, the moment a, you see A, just, it, is, it, is, it is marketable. <laughs> it is marketable. That, that's okay. the strategy. But I don't know what happened in Ogo State because you also notice that the former governor of Ondo State started a Zenith Labour Party. Yes. And I was wondering, until I thought about it, you see, the word Zenith, Z, will be the last in the mm -hmm. ballot mm. paper. So you can easily market some of this party. AA is top. That's why they are moving to AA. Mm. And you can market it to people where you get there is number one number one, Just number one. <laughs> press number one <laughs> okay. inflation rate in the meantime to trend towards 13 percent in 2019 and that's uh, in uh, complete uh, uh, opposite of what the CBN is saying. Exactly. They've been talking about 11.4% uh, being projected for 2019. Mm. Uh, last respects for Bush 
all the U former presidents here and of course their wives here donald trump uh barack obama clinton, uh, clinton. and jimmy carter mm -hmm. And uh, the body language seemed... The body language. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> the was body language. Somehow, especially between the Obamas. Obama and, and the... Uh, which is understandable. And it was, it was even said that the, 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 the Trumps and the Clintons didn't shake hands. Mm -hmm. Wow, okay. They treated each other like lepers. <laughs> really sad. Okay, what else do we have? I guess that will be it. Unless, of course, you want me to go to Mr. and Mrs. Uh, and I will not because Well, we it's not time. a Friday yet, so it's let's not, move on. Okay, this day on. is our next paper now. Don't sell your future. Atiku urges Nigerians mm. accuses APC of buying PVCs for 10 naira, gets mm -hmm. uh, 45 political parties endorsement, and storms Ibadan today for Southwest Rally. Okay, uh, they were in uh, Ilori yesterday for the North Central Rally. Mm. A signed Electoral Act Amendment Bill now. Saraki tells Buhari and Agbaji Lagos no longer industrial hub of Nigeria. Uh, okay. And it's that's one of politics. the reasons he wants to take over as governor. All right. Yeah. And federal government uh, targets 900 billion naira from offshore tax uh, assets. Uh, hold emergency federal executive council meeting tomorrow over 2019 budget. Uh, CBN intensified excess liquidity mop up. Okay. Those are some of the. Uh, yeah. And if you see the picture on the front uh, page of the This Day newspaper, it's a door to door there. You see the vice president. Yeah, Mia Shibaja with members of the Danjuma Dimiko family in their compound in Karu community, Abuja, during the vice president's visit to the community. Now, he has been doing a door-to-door -door campaign yes. around uh, Abuja and the environs and all of that. And he's been meeting a lot of people, yeah. women, children, you, you know, Giving you that personal exactly. touch. Yeah, you, you see, I've talked, about, I've, I've talked about um, character of leadership. Mm. And the letter are there means returning power to the people. It, leading the people does not mean that you have to sit in Abuja and make the problem of Nigeria very, very complex to the point that you cannot attend to the needs of the people. Mm -hmm. You see, it is not about doing what you think is right for the people. It's about doing what the people want at every point in time. Yeah. That's the hallmark of leadership. And until we get to this point, beyond election year, beyond when we want to campaign, mm. until we engage the people in the real sense of it and ask them exactly what they want. But and can you we, honestly we say that, it. Dr. John, in, you know, with, with our circumstances and the level of uh, enlightenment or education within the masses, do the people really know what they want? I mean, you think that you actually need a kind of leadership that is visionary enough to, you know, get to the mountaintop and say, look, this is a vision that I have for the people. Not necessarily because it's about him, a but because it's, what, because it's what said, will be good for the people at the end yes, of the day. Yes, a politician said the, what, you, what you term good or bad is relative. It if, is. If all the people want something that is bad, as far as they are the ones who want it, give it to them. You, you see, if you at every point in time that your hand does not agree with your heart, mm. frustration mm. will always come. Mm. Okay. So that's the need. Either you're seen from the mountain top, there's the need for you to averagely carry the people along, not oh, just ab do things that, yeah. that, that they do not need yeah. or want or like. Or okay. Right. So the Daily Trust, let's see how we like this headline. How we lost 16 policemen and rescued 20 others in Zamfara. Police opening up on clash uh, with uh, bandits there yeah. in, in Zamfara. Um, the police, well, they've, they've been, you know, uh, putting you, it out there, yes. putting the facts out there. You know, it's very, it, it, it can be so, so very easy for you and I to condemn um, the Nigerian police mm. as it is. But I tell you that these guys are going through a lot. Many of them will die. Uh, you know, you know, my, many of them will die and the system will not attend no, to their no, family. No news about so they don't even have a reason to die for the system in the first place. Yeah. So the only thing they can do is to secure um, their future by taking perhaps 15 or 100 naira and keeping it somewhere. Unfortunately, even when they take this money with their school. salary, it yeah. can't secure their future it because doesn't. about 70% of the salary goes on Ogogoro, majority <laughs> of them. And 30% <laughs> they move from one Babalawo to the other because when the government fails to provide the basic thing they need. Ogogoro is the local gene, isn't it? Okay, yeah. okay. The local okay. brew. Okay, uh, <laughs> yellow fever hits 10 at those local government areas. Yellow fever is oh. making a comeback. Mm. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, it's really sad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think we should not just uh, limit it to the pages of the newspaper. Exactly, I think we should take action, take action, action, take action as quickly as possible, so it doesn't uh, yeah. go beyond. Uh, do opposition parties threaten showdown over electoral bill. Recovered loots will fund only budgeted pro projects. That's I didn't get that. Recovered loot will fund only budgeted.
projects. Okay, that's a that, that means it's going to reduce yeah, sure. our borrowing this thing because, yeah. for uh, for example, if we had planned that we are going to borrow so so amount of money mm -hmm. and we're able to recover it, then it's going to reduce yeah. at the end of the but day. But part of the abacha loot has has gone into trader money already. Yeah, but they said that's one of the conditions now. Okay. That's, I, I didn't yeah. read it, but they said that's one of the conditions. Yes. And it actually the signed with the Swiss government. But, but but they should not play politics with it because politics okay. is not part of the condition. That's all right. Right. Get to everyone. Thank right. you very much, Dr. Thank you, Dr. As for always. Coming. It's a pleasure, Les. Mm.